her first concert. And it was a night to remember and to share it with her is something that I will never forget. And that's the magic of Beyonce's Renaissance World Tour. Yes, it was <laughs> everything. <laughs> well, you know, that impact really extends to the creative community as well. Our reporter, Leslie Delisbore, amplifying the voice of a local artist who gave Beyonce's crew a piece of Kansas City. As an artist and celebrity fashion designer, Cartel Styles wears many hats, including a member of the Beehive. Beyonce is, is Beyonce. Like many, Cartel was thrilled to have Beyonce and her tour here in KC, something he says is huge for our city. Kansas City is considered kind of a smaller city, so I think that having her come here to end the tour is kind of like kind of like a blessing in disguise. A blessing for many creatives like himself to craft their own masterpiece, which he did by drawing up a piece of Kansas City for two of Beyonce's top dancers. To watch all of my passion go into the art and then be able to present it to somebody and watch their reaction is um, surreal. They're kind of arguably the best dancers in the world and I think it's just an honor to be able to present to somebody like the Les Twins. As a creative, Cartel says this kind of opportunity can leave a huge mark on others like him who want to paint a picture showing Kansas City's continuous growth in hopes it will leave a huge mark on people across the world. We have so many talented artists. I'm not the only one. There's so many talented artists around here and that it's very important that you support. It kind of shows people in Kansas City that there are opportunities to become somebody as big as Beyonce and to create on that type of level to work with Beyonce. In Kansas City, Leslie Dallasport, KSHB 41 News.